my name is Lucy Montgomery. I am co-writer of Dodger and I play Minnie, who is Fagin's landlady, so I run the pub. Obviously, everyone's got their own look. We've got the low class, who are quite grubby and they've got terrible teeth and various amazing scars. And then we've got the richer characters, like the chief of police, who has lovely poofy hair. Dodger himself, even though he's only young, he's had quite a hard life, so that's reflected in his, in his face. Again, he's never brushed his teeth. He's got to be really, really dirty, like really grimy, really bad teeth, making him look like really worn in dirt. And then obviously he's got a few stories to tell, so he's got a scar as well. Shark bit in the face. What, on the streets of London? In the streets of London. We use kind of like an alcohol-based paint so it doesn't come off and just kind of really wear it in so it looks like it's um, been there a while. So yeah, I go home like that every night. There was quite a lot of mud, wasn't there? Yeah. So not real dirt, obviously. No, we don't use real dirt, no. I have they do this sponge and they put it in like <laughs> mud and they do your legs. What Annie used to do is she used to have actually like a a bucket of mud. You put it all over your face, <laughs> your legs, and it was it looked like Nutella, you know, you scoop up a bit of Nutella. Yeah, I've got quite bad teeth. So to do the teeth just takes about five minutes. You know, so we use like alcohol-based paint, so there's a few different colours. So we've got a bit of brown, a bit of green, like the rot in there. It tastes of nail varnish. <laughs> uh, okay, go your nose. And you cut the teeth on, and it touches your tongue. You're oh, done. You, you are done. Because they didn't really show their teeth in that time, did they? But if they took a photo, they'd just be like this. So you've got to brush your teeth, kids. Number one thing. Minnie dyes her own hair using a very special secret ingredient um, she collects from the pub toilets. Don't try that at home. <laughs> I had a wick man from the sailors. It's what I use on my lovely blonde hair. So that's how she gets her signature um, blonde look. These days we don't have to do that, so that's all right. I think this could start a trend though. What do you reckon? This could be the new look, yeah? What you got to do is that you've got to first buy yourself a nice, horrible white shirt. Then you want to have a nice black tight jacket, you want some baggy trousers, some clunky shoes, and then um, you just get a top hat and I think you're ready to go.